All right, hello everyone, and welcome to the very first of its kind endurance event, a King of the Hill style event, created by the one and only Spidey up above me. What's going on, Spidey? How are you doing today? Good one. How's it going, man? It's going well. So I'm really excited to, uh, you know, to, to do this event. We've been talking about this for a long time now, and it's really great to make this happen. So for those who don't know, we are going to be doing giving away 1,000 pearls to the winner of this event. And the way that someone's going to win this event is whoever wins the most battles. So they're going into 1v1 style battles. We already have our first two contenders here and ready. Pretty awesome. I'm excited. I'm excited. Yeah, dude, it's hype. I'm ready to go, man. Ready to go. So like I said, we already have our first two contenders here ready, and we already have an amazing, it looks like 40-ish viewers right now in the chat or, you know, on YouTube, watching and ready to go. Let's get some, the next people in line. There's a few of them that are trying to jump in, and that's, that's fine with me. Whoever they want to, to get in here, whoever's ready to go next. <laughs> Bitter's in there saying hi to the, uh, the YouTube. Bit of slew and bit of steel. Who's who, huh? So, do you want... <laughs> so, bitter slew, that's uh, that's ancient frogman. <laughs> Being silly. Let's see, there's someone here. There we go. There's JP. He'll be up next to battle. Okay. Yo, JP and sideline gamers in there, too. Yep. Got him. Okay, so those are the two that I can do. All right, so our first map is going to be on First Flood. Remember, we're only using the small maps. Because this is going to be a 1v1, we want uh, we don't want anyone being able to run and hide. Now, there's also another interesting rule that we have, and that's what we call our camping timer. So what we mean by this camping timer specifically is... You know, we're all for people being able to go and retreat, uh, you know, to regain some health. However, the one thing that we don't want is someone sitting in behind a rock the whole entire time or the whole entire battle and then running away the whole entire battle. And it's just, it's not fun for the, the guy who's running away and it's not fun for the person who's, you know, trying to chase the guy. So the way that we're working this is you'll have 15 seconds or three bandage ticks, whichever one happens first, after engaging the enemy to return to battle. That gives you enough time for your Tesla shields to cool down. Uh, that also get you know, if you're running one of those, your Tesla bolts to be able to ready to go again. Uh, but, you know, I gave an example of if you stun someone uh, with a 16 second stun and run away, the timer starts as soon as you run away. However, if you stun and circle the enemy waiting for your weapons to cool down, that's going to be considered actively engaging the enemy. So you don't have to worry about your timers not uh, not meshing up like that. So you're still good to weapon. You let your weapons cool down. But if you just stun and run away, we're going to take 10% uh, away from your damage percentage if you end up forcing a draw. So. And then let's really? go ahead and cover. You want to cover how the, uh, the draws are going to work? Well... The way we did that, I was just going to say, we're ready for lots of action, man. That's what we want to see. We want to see these guys going at it. Absolutely. Who are you going to uh, spectate? I, uh, I'm on Soldado right now. All right. I'm going to uh, swap over to Oroku. So Oroku's in an Enforcer. Very nice. Double Blast. Interesting setup. Got the first hit of the game there. Yeah, he did. Uh, tier five, he's got a tier five rare blast cannon and a tier one legendary blast cannon. Well, he just took his Tesla shield down. It just popped it and it just went off. This is what we like to see in the first game though. They're both going at it. Definitely keeping it head to head, that's for sure. <clears throat> uh oh, looks like he's getting ready to stun him. Uh oh. Yeah, there he goes. You would think a little bit that a Roku would have an advantage with an extra weapon. Same kind of agility, but uh, not looking out that way. Ooh, nice avoiding there. Oh, Ooh. there it is. Bet he gets dropped. Good so game. With the win, yeah. Good game. Glad to have you there. Glad to have you there. All right. So now what we're going to go ahead and do is we are going to go to our scorecard here. So our very first winner here is going to be Soldado. Man, 
he's got himself a score of one. There we go. And then whoever wins the next battle will get themselves on the scoreboard as well. No, Soldado, don't go anywhere. Stay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you got to stay, dude. <laughs> Aruku, thanks, man. Appreciate you showing up. It was a good try, dude. Good try. <laughs> Where did he go? <laughs> Why did he leave? <laughs> you got to stick around, bro. Remember, yeah. you, you keep going until, until you lose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't even see him in the chat either. <laughs> He's there. I got him again. Oh, you got him? Uh, okay. Yeah, I just right. need him to accept. <clears throat> <laughs> oh, that's funny. All right, <laughs> let's see here. It happens. Not a big deal. All right, let's see. Who is next to get added in? Let's see. We're going to go ahead and add in Legend Monster. Legend Monster over here will be next up. All right, so the next map we're going to go to is Brawl Park. So what I don't want to do is have the one person get it every single time, or the, you know, if we have one person winning multiple times, that they uh, that they do that. Pitter Sue wants to club them seals. No, that's not going to happen. <laughs> don't oh, yeah, I got to go back to the live feed. feed. Yeah. Yep. There we go. <laughs> that could have been bad. <laughs> All <laughs> right. Thanks for that warning there, American Rotter and Spidey, for getting me on that. Thank you so much. All right. Almost, uh, almost made a rookie move there. You know, the kind you hate to see. Yeah. So we got Speeder versus Shooter this time. Let's see if Soldado can uh, work some magic again. All right. So let's wait till they start actively engaging, and then, like I said, remember if they run away, you got to start that timer now. So we're gonna. That blast cannon, man. 1200 for a level 1 legendary. That's pretty nice. For these low level guys. I want to look at his perks, bit. actually. I want to see what he's running. I get the feeling he's got to be running all damage perks. What do you think? Uh, yeah, yeah, I think so. Especially not running fire. Absolutely. He's shot. making really good use of that stun. He's timing it just right. Yeah, he's definitely uh, he's definitely maneuvering himself into good positions to shoot and kind of get away and come back and shoot some more. And, and he's got a band-aid too. Nice. That he does. He's almost back to full health. There he is, back to full health. Mm -hmm. But he needs to get in there and start engaging the enemy. Otherwise, he's gonna he's gonna end up getting hit. I know he's trying. He's looking for it. JP's doing a good job of uh, staying distant here. I think. That's I don't think he's trying. I think he's actually just trying to chase him down, and they're both kind of going in circles right now. But <laughs> it's pretty obvious to me that they're both actively searching for each yep, other. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Just didn't work out that way. <laughs> oh, those are rough weapons to run into, uh, you know, to go up against a speeder with. Yeah. Especially the yeah. torpedo. The JP's got a nice looking load out there. He just can't seem to get a shot out when he wants to. Oh man, that's done. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That is so frustrating. It definitely I, uh, is. It's. Uh, it's the hardest part of any 1v1. Yeah, it is. No, I don't I, I don't know if this is Soldado's usual setup to run a stun like that. I know. It's definitely effective in a 1v1 situation yeah, though, that's absolutely, for sure. Absolutely, yeah. Absolutely. This is uh I think we're uh, we're almost done here. One more shot with that gray one. Oh. Yeah, there you go. There it is, Soldado <laughs> with win number two. Nice job, Soldado. Definitely nicely done. All right. So here we are. We've already updated the scorecard here. You can see that Soldado is now in the lead with two victories right off the bat. Well done. Well done. JP, thank you so much for getting in there. Yep, thanks, JP. Sideline Gamer, you're next. All right, let's get T-Rex invited to the lobby. Let's also get...
Sato invited to the lobby. Invite to the lobby. All right, let's get both of you guys invited over. Back to the live scene here. Looks like we've got our first contender for the uh, Soldado's tearing it up for two games already. That he is. He's definitely getting it out there. Uh, do you want to change the map again to... Uh, yep. Let's go to Cold Riddance for this one. Cold Riddance. I couldn't think of the name. <laughs> My brain stopped working. All right. Here we go. Here we go. This is I'm, This is really good. This is shaping up to be really well. What's going on, everyone in the chat? How are you all doing today? What's up, Jordy? Uh, Vermilion, yeah, I mean, if you win, you can change to whatever you want after the, you know, before you go into the next battle. Absolutely. Nice shot with the stun there. Are you still watching, Soldado? I am, yeah. We got the, the same speed of us as shooter again. And... Let's see what... So, Sideline Gamer... There he goes. Nicely done. Look at this. We got Royalty92 coming in with one of his $1 hollas. Thank you so much for your donation, man. That's awesome. I'm so excited that we finally got this enabled for the Tubers channel so we can start really working towards making the group bigger and better. Sideline Gamer's actually doing a little bit. He's, he's landing his shots. I think the key here is if he stays in the capture, he's going to make Soldado come to him. And... Well, Soldado also knows that you can't sit back for more than 15 seconds. You know, you, right. you have yeah. to engage no matter what, which is just enough time for his Tesla bolt to cool down. So it works out for him in that manner. <laughs> he is a good shot with that ball, uh, Tesla bolt. Too. That he definitely is. <laughs> Just a little and by you can little. tell you can tell that he has the training for it, which removes the uh, you know blocks all repairs. This yep. is not it. You see that sideline gamer's not getting any bandage heals while he's got that Tesla bolt on him. Yeah, definitely. He's playing a very patient game. That's uh, one thing I can't do is play patiently. I'm always aggressive. But, uh, Soldado got his tactics down pretty good here. He's definitely just picking him off. Vermillion, yeah, I I don't want to say that. It's a tactic, you know, and it's a tactic that people should be well aware of in 1v1 situations. Uh, if anyone ever played the 1v1 event or even the 2v2s, they definitely should be aware that this is a distinct possibility of what you'll be going up against. Oh, man, that should have been a hit. Um, yeah, I'm not sure what happened there. It looked like it hit him right on the back of the boat. Two in a row he's missed with that ball. We got, we got done saying how good he was with it, and he missed twice. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that the way how it usually works? Yeah, I think so, yeah. John A., how are you doing? Good game earlier. You know, it's unfortunate he didn't win, but that's okay. Uh, there will be the next event in December. There he goes. Got him. Man, but he's getting stunned for that whole duration there. Yeah. <laughs> Play game. <laughs> One at versus Spidey. <laughs> One at versus Spidey for the finals. I don't know. I don't think I'm good enough to do that. <laughs> Ooh. I think all the walls would be Oh, good. man. There Soldado is. going for victory number three. Can anyone beat Soldado today? Is anyone going to be able to yeah. do that? Yeah. It's not looking like it so far. Not so far. Not Sideline so far. game at GG, man. Thanks for stopping by. We appreciate you participating. All right, let me see here. Who wants to be next? All right, we got T-Rex ready, so I need to get whoever is in the next one here. I don't remember that name. 
need to check my list and verify real quick. Legend Mall. First Fox guy is not registered. America. Kenza. What's up, Kenza? He said America Marauder versus Soldado. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's mo funny. My that money would be funny. on Soldado. <laughs> and fingers, this is the lower level gear score. All right. Yeah, this is the this is the category one, which is basically 5500 to 8500 gear scores now we'll let players in who are less than that but we want them to know you know what the range really is meant for and if you want to compete we're not going to turn you down so definitely aren't going to do that all right so we're back to first flood now back to the small map i think you muted yourself wasn't it no i don't i don't think i did oh okay <laughs> it just went quiet oh <laughs> i'm like what Uh, Jonah, we're not sure when it's going to be in December yet. Right now we're looking at either the 8th or the 22nd for December's event. But we're we're working on getting some outside sponsors for that event. So we have a, we still have more work to do. Let's see what happens. So here's another individual who's braving to go with Shooter. So T-Rex, I was just looking at T-Rex's loadout here and... Uh... Uh, I, I'm not sure. Uh, the key here for him is to, gonna be to get up close, or a little closer than than the other guys have so far. Uh, he's gonna. Uh, gaming with fear. You said so. If you dropped your gear score, you could play against that speed or no? Uh, we have the we have individuals actually send us videos of their inventories and going through their ships to verify that they actually belong in the gear score category that they're registered for. So if you could reach a higher level category, even if you don't plan to use that gear, you still have to fight in that category. Man, that was a huge crit that he got with that blast cannon. Yeah. Oh, yeah. wow, look at that. Oh, point blank miss. There's nice crit. crit. Yeah. That's what I said. I thought T-Rex had to get up close and personal in this battle for him to stand a chance, I think. Now, Sadato, he's going to have to make sure that he doesn't run away too long. So he's already running away. He's still engaging. Uh, no, I'm not sure about that. If you can get a hit off a wall or a, something like that, you, you're going to get a chance. It's going gonna, it's gonna to do right. some damage. He's got to get out there and start engaging now. That was already the third bandage tick, so he needs to get into the fight. Otherwise, he's going to start losing percentage. I think what T-Rex needs to do here is uh, get to the capture zone and put a little pressure on Soldado, make him come out. <laughs> it's a, it's a He's chipping him away. He definitely is, yeah. Not sure if T-Rex here is wearing a bandage. I didn't see it tick over. No, he's not. So he looks like he's two shots away right now. So although they're slowly gaining his health back, and he's got to move in for the kill here pretty quick, I think. Nice, oh, off the shit. wall. Yeah. Oh, this is going to be close. Oh, oh Sedato with a fourth victory. <laughs> wow, Sedato with a fourth victory. Nice. Wow, yeah. 
Man. Yes, I know, guys. I forgot to fix the camera angle. I'm very sorry about that. <laughs> I, I got it fixed. Very sorry. Wow. Nicely done. Soldado with four victories in a row. Very nicely done. He is kicking butt and taking everyone's name. T-Rex, thank you so much for coming out. All right, so we got Sado Masochist is going to be up next. Let's go ahead and get Legend Monsters already in there. Epic plays. Mr. Dory. Is got him. Okay. Dory. All good. Let's get him invited to the lobby. There's a bunch of people who are registered. So let me see here. I already sent invites. <laughs> oh, you got him as well. Thanks. Yeah, he just <laughs> left though too. All right. Well, he let's. Just... I guess let's reinvite him. <laughs> Oh, boy. All right. So the next map again, let's go ahead and make our way through. We'll go ahead and go to Brawl Park. Changed up. All right. Here we go. Speeder versus Speeder. American Marauder. That's funny. <laughs> here we go. Yellow versus Yellow. This. Let's see what happens here. At Royalty 92 to Category 1. <laughs> Yeah, that sounds really balanced there, Royalty. <laughs> That's like one shot from that tier 5 railgun, and he's done. Hi, Charlie. How are you doing today? Welcome to yeah. the stream. Fixer Swag, hey, what's up? Ham Fingers, Hazardous, Death MLG. How is everyone doing today? Woo, look at this. Looks like, looks like Sato over here is running with dual carronades. That can be an absolutely lethal setup. That, yeah. Especially since this most recent update where they took away all of the defense and now all of your perks are, or your talents are maxed out or they can potentially be maxed out. So you don't have to worry about losing out on any of the benefits. It's a, uh, carronades have become an amazing weapon. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm sad that I scrapped all of my carronades because I, I'm, I'm kind of kicking myself. I regret it a whole lot now. It looks like Soldado's got his number here. and It does. It looks like, oh, yeah, oh victory oh, number yeah. five. Nice shot, dude. That was impressive. All the way across that the was. map. That was definitely an impressive yeah. shot there. Nicely done. Wow. I nail 100% agree with you, dude. Uh, Sado Masochist needed to go uh, get a little closer there. And uh, he would have been a little better off, I think. Genzer, I definitely did notice the two overboosts along with one Nitro. He wasn't rocking out with any type of uh, stun or defensive type weapons anyways, or items, you know, such as Tesla Shield or Tesla Bolt. Oh, good try, Sato. Good try. All right. Let's see here. Next up is going to be SRG Bull. <laughs> Legend Monster seems to think that I'm going up against him. Dude, I'm spectating. <laughs> Hosting the custom so it can be live streamed. <laughs> oh, man. Nicely done. Okay, who else do we need to get? Who else is in there am I missing anyone I don't think I am I don't think I am all right who else is ready let's uh switch back to the live feed there too won't it there we go oh there you go. <laughs> sideline game uh I don't think so dude it looked like he was lagging a little bit, but I didn't see anything out of the ordinary there. <laughs> he just messaged me on Discord. There we go. There we got Gamer Hype. Let's get him invited to the lobby over here. All right. <laughs> All right, SRG Bull. Is he going to be the guy? Is he going to be the one? to unseat Soldado. Is he going to be the one? 
Got another shooter. Interesting. I don't know that I would have ran with this setup, but he's rocking out with a mine. Not, it's obviously not his only weapon, but he does have a mine, so that's interesting. I don't know, but on this small map, that could work into his favor. Uh, yeah. He's got a couple long-range weapons in the napalm and the long-range mortar there. Let's uh, see if he can be effective with those and get a little bit of damage. Soldado's missing with all of them there. It's the uh, 1,000 pearl question, Jordy. Who can take <laughs> out this speeder? That is indeed the question. And I guess the answer right now is nobody. <laughs> so for anyone who has questions about when the next one is going to be, the next category is going to start in two hours from now. So that'll be at 19.30 my time, which is GMT minus 5, or Eastern Standard Time. I don't think anyone's doing any damage yet. No, not yet. <laughs> it, looks, it looks like Soldado lost his mojo because he shot a couple times. Oh, there he goes. He landed a shot. And he's dangerously close to that mine right there, too, so... It'll be interesting know. to see whether or not he's actually able to make that work. I mean, if I were him, yeah. I'd be lobbing this napalm up into that spot. There he goes. Now, if it wasn't the napalm, I would have definitely done the napalm. Definitely. There he goes. Putting it right up against the rock there. That's a good place for it. He's, got, he's such a good shot with that uh, bolt. He definitely is. Far better than I could ever do. I am not that good with a bolt. I can't aim it to save my life. And again, oh, I can't right. aim any of my weapons to save my <laughs> life. <laughs> uh, Charlie was, was, I'm sorry, go ahead. Uh, uh, Charlie, the name Endurance was something that we came up with uh, just to see. It's a 1v1 King of the Hill style tournament. Let's see how long you can last and who can win the most games. Yep. It is, Chili Cut. This is King of the Hill. So, it's kind of like King of the Hill mixed with a bit of Bowl in the Ring. I don't know if you know what Bowl in the Ring is, but, man, it's a, right. essentially another name for King of the Hill. But it's a 1v1, and the winner stays and keeps fighting until they eventually get beaten. And then whoever has the most wins at the end of the event is the individual who wins the 1,000 pearls. Now we're already looking at... We're looking at Soldado here with six victories. SRG Bowl, thank you so much for coming out. King of the water. Yeah, there really aren't any hills in this game, are there? Mm -hmm. <laughs> for maybe that infamy hill. All right, let's get Legend Monster put in here. All right, the next yeah. battle is going to be on Cold Riddance. Captain of the Waves. That's a good one, Molly Pig. And now let's keep it civil, please, if you don't mind. Indeed. I second that. Charlie says he wants a thousand pulls. <laughs> Go to enter up, Charlie. Fine, I don't care who goes first. <laughs> uh, guys, you can't. Once you have your first battle, that's it. You only get the one shot. It's one and done. Back to live one. It? Oh, yeah, that'd probably be a good idea. <laughs> that would probably be a good idea. Thanks for uh, thanks for reminding me. <laughs> I keep trying to do that. So it seems to... I haven't seen a shooter really without the big torpedo, except for the last one. The last one, the shooter had, you know, brought a mine instead. But they all seem yeah. to be running, for the most part, a big torpedo. It's interesting. I, uh, looking at Epic's layout here, I... Uh... I think this is going to be Soldado's toughest contest yet. Yeah? Epic Plays has some pretty nice looking weapons there. Tier 4 uh, Epic Blast Cannon and Grenade, and a Tier 3 legend, uh, Epic Sniper, and then a Legendary Blast Cannon. Come on, guys. You want to get back into yeah. the fight here. 
<laughs> I of Doom says pushing. he'll dethrone this guy. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Soldado, you gotta get in there. Ooh, nice! Ouch. That was huge. Good shot by Epic Plays. That was a really good shot. I think ah. Epic's, Epic's playing it right here now. I think uh, putting pressure on Soldado in the capture zone. Absolutely. You know, I definitely agree. He's definitely doing a pretty good job. He's gonna have to force him to come out. Yep. He's making his glass cannons almost worthless. Yeah, definitely. The only downside is, is he's also eliminating his ability to use any of those items, too. Ooh, right. wow, nice. There he goes, Soldado. He's making his move. Oh, Stuns nice done. Nice done. But he's still going to have to get in there and try and actually hit him. Oh, there he goes. There, yep, there it is. Gonna kill that wall. <laughs> <laughs> That's usually my trick, Hamping, is most of my shots hit a wall. <laughs> Funny. Epic Plays has got a bandage on as well, though, so he's gonna heal up the same time Soldado is. Alright, guys, we need a little action here. Let's Come go. Come on, guys. You gotta get in the battle. You gotta get in the battle. You guys need to be actively engaging each other. If it ends up a draw, I will have to go through how the draws work. So the way that uh, draws work, for those of you who would like to know, there will be no draws. The winner will be determined based off of a damage percentage of total health. So we know that Soldado here has 5370 and Epic Plays has 8509 basically the way that this will work is however much damage they do or it's going to be taken a percentage of however much health the individual has and then the person with the higher percentage will win and fingers both guys are actually running band-aids right now yep so. that they are Close to that grenade, dude. <laughs> Kenza. <laughs> and if this does head to a draw, this might actually be Soldado's first loss. We'll have to see. Ooh, nice shot. That's a good crit there. Oh, he's on fire. Oh, he's Whoa. got him again. Oh, narrow miss. <laughs> Come on, guys. Be yeah, I think, I think Epic needs to, uh, to to push a little bit here. He needed to push when he had a lot of down low like that. It's all right. Like I said, it's going to, you know, because we have that requirement for the, uh, you know, for the health to dam or damage to health ratio, you know, the, that percentage. It's possible that Epic Plays may still end up coming out victorious here. Yeah, it's definitely possible. And it's meant specifically to combat situations like this. Oh, oh Epic oh. Plays gets the kill with 10 seconds left on the clock. Wow. Nicely done. Someone has finally unseat. Soldado as the current reigning victor. Now, Soldado is obviously still very much in the lead in regards to um, in regards to wins. So you know, it's not uh, it's not something that you know it doesn't automatically go away. I just don't know why that doesn't show up. The uh, the at symbol and the uh, the dollar sign symbol on that font doesn't want to show up. So we're just gonna do it as epic plays. Oh, <laughs> silly. <laughs> That's silly. Good job, Epic Plays Soldado. Yep, Thank nice. you so much. Just stick around. All right. I'll be reaching out to you most likely a little bit later. All right. Almost yeah, kicked thanks. out Epic Plays. I was getting used to doing that. Thanks, Soldado. Great showing, man. Excellent job. Well done. Good games. Wow. Nicely done.
Nicely done. All right, so now we're going to go ahead and rotate back to the first flood map. Let's get us back to our live scene here. Oh, who just left? Legend uh, Dragon. Why did Legend name? Monster leave? Legend Monster. Yeah. Where'd you go, Legend Monster? Why'd you leave? I don't know why he left. I don't know why he left. All right, there he is. He's back. All right. Epic plays and gamer hype. Let's go. Ooh, gamer hype's running himself a defender here. <laughs> Interesting. Is, I, I took a little sneak peek there, and uh, yeah, this is going to be a. Interesting. Interesting, yeah. Uh, Here Game we go, Hypes, man. His strategy has got to be charged. I mean, it's got to be. There's no way he can sit back and uh, and wait. He's got to go straight for epic plays with just brute force and anything else that comes with that. Yeah, I'm, I'm anxious to see. I'm actually going to be spectating Gamer Hype. He's rocking out with an explosive cannon, a blast cannon, and a swift torpedo. It's nice. And that, that explosive cannon is a tier 5 epic. Oh. <laughs> nice. Ep epic Plays is making some smart choices here. He's, he's playing the safe game behind the rock. Getting in a little dink here and there. Game Hives Rock can double bandage, too. He is. Oh. I don't know what's going to be the best route here. You know, Gamer Hype, he has the potential to get a lot of damage, but... He has weapons with a very long cooldown. Yeah, definitely. And uh, I think, again, Epic Plays is playing it pretty smart here. He's uh, putting that rock between him and Game of Hype, kind of poking out, shooting him, and... Shot. Him. Gamer Hype's kind of doing the same thing. He's he's playing a little bit smart now. He's looking at the fact that, you know, he can, he can play a game of attrition here. He has more bandages. He can heal up more health than Epic Plays can heal up every, you know, five seconds. So he has the ability to regenerate enough. And all he's got to do is really just get those one shots like what he just did there. Nicely done. Oh, yeah. but that's huge. Oh, 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 oh that is huge. Another interesting fact here, uh, I don't know who this is, 729-835-9549 in the chat. So they're both in the same guild. That's, uh, <laughs> that's I didn't even notice that. This one as well. Yeah, there is some bragging rights with this one. <laughs> Charlie said there should be in-game modes for customs, or game modes for customs. Oh, I agree. Oh, no. Oh, he got lit on fire. That's oh. it. That's oh. it. Can he live? Can he survive? Oh. <laughs> oh my goodness, he survived that. Wow, 128 HP. <laughs> I can't believe he survived that. Now this is where those bandages are really gonna make the make the difference here. Yep. Oh, nice. Yeah. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> down he goes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was so close to an upset. I was almost I was rooting for him. I really wanted him to get that. Nicely done. Epic plays. Well done, gamer hype. Well yeah. played. Well played. All right. Let's go ahead and update the scorecards here so that way everyone here can see. Epic plays now has two victories. Nicely done. Epic plays. Well done. Yep. Thanks, gamer hype. Great battle, dude. Absolutely, um, dude. Thank you so much. All right, Legend Monster, you're the last one. You are the last one. Let's see, who else do we have? Is anyone else from the... Uh... Let's see. I wasn't going to be able to... Go back into the chat here real quick and see if anyone else is trying to get in there. <laughs> Sloop. All right, we're going on the brawl park for this battle here. All right, shooter versus shooter. Oh, don't forget to switch the screen. Oh, yep. Sorry, sorry, I. I know, bad me, bad me. <laughs> uh, restless dude, no, they had to sign up uh, to battle. 
I know, rookie move, man. I keep doing it. <laughs> so right now, it looks like Legend Monsters are rocking double explosive cannon, sniper firebomb, and a ballpark. I know, I deserve the noob comments, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> totally deserve them. They're 100% justified. <laughs> uh, Charlie Goldman, what's the gear score rule? So we have three different categories. The first one's 55 to 8,500. The second's 8,500 to 11,500. And then 11,500 and beyond. Uh, you are not allowed to intentionally lower your gear score to get into a lower category. Uh, if anyone gets caught doing that, they either are asked to move up or they can forfeit. And then, yeah, that's pretty much it. Now, during the tournaments, if, uh, if we gave them the opportunity and they, you know, and we find out later on that they hid stuff, then they get banned from our tournaments for six months. So we got them up close and personal action here, one that they decided they were that. just gonna go for it and it seems like Epic Plays is getting the better of the exchanges that they win. Definitely is. He has, you know, weapons that are able to to really inflict some serious pain on another shooter. Oh, there he is. Epic plays going for the third victory there. Nicely done. Nicely done. <laughs> Royalty. Section How are you category, category two. two, bro? <laughs> <laughs> How are you category two? That's funny. All right. Good game there, Legend Monster. Thank you so much for joining us out there. All right. There you go. Now you guys got that scorecard. Legend Monster wants to go again. That's not the way it works, Brotato. I am very sorry about that. Let's see here. Now there is one other individual. He said he's on his way, so he's got three minutes to get here. Uh, so we're going to give him just those couple of minutes and wait for him to arrive. Uh, I mean, so what have you thought so far, Spidey? I mean, is this shaping up to be the way you thought it was going to be? Oh, absolutely, man. This is epic. I love it. It's great. These guys are not holding back at all. They're going for it and they, they want those thousand pearls, man. That's what, that's bottom line. Yeah, I mean, it's it's definitely been fun. It's been a lot of fun. This has been awesome. Yeah, definitely. I can't definitely. wait to get into some of the bigger categories. You know, category two, I just want to see I want to see more of that, you know, real in-your-face, let me That's, shoot yeah. you and gun you down. <laughs> like, I want to see that. You know, I want to see these boats blowing each other up. Up close and personal, man. Up close and personal. <laughs> Vincent, can I join join and play with my screen turned off? No. <laughs> What's up, squad? How's it going? Dude? Oh, man. That's funny. All right. Let's see here. Come on. Let's go. Where is he? I need MVP's Whoa. alter ego. Hurry up, MVP's oh. alter ego. <laughs> then the player in the number one spot will win. Waves. Uh, Mr. Mr. We really can't make any different rules regarding capture. You know, that's that's a good tactic to winning is if your opponent doesn't want to come out and fight and you go to the capture zone, you're forcing him to come out and fight or lose. To be honest, if it were up to me, I you know, if the game allowed for us to be able to customize our custom battles to where we could actually, you know, put in, you know, the, do you guys know the cap or what is it? The cap or kill, I believe, where it increases exponentially, like each person counts for three seconds instead of one second. Uh, I would love to have that in custom events like this to where we can make it so that way every second's actually worth five seconds. So you only have or even yeah, five seconds would be great. That way, yeah. you only have to be in there for 12 seconds. You really got to force someone to get out there and do what they need to do. That'd be awesome. I don't know who Ow is. Who's Ow? <laughs> he's the guy. He's in the Discord right now. Uh, yeah, but he's Rogue not. Rogue Blueberry? Oh, is that Rogue Blueberry? Yeah, yeah that's him. Oh, okay. I have him as a different name, but yep, that matches the uh, matches. All right, there we go. Rogue Blueberry. That's a. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we on cold riddance this time. 
Let's do it. Cool moves, yeah. All hey, right, guys, up? this what is up? the last battle of Category 1. Last battle of Category 1. <laughs> Fixa, we have no way of knowing who liked and disliked the stream. Absolutely no way, dude. Yeah, I have no idea. <laughs> if someone dislikes the stream, that's okay, because YouTube counts it as an interaction, so it's still good for us. <laughs> That's all that matters, right? Absolutely. So we got Shooter versus Shooter. I can only pull from the people that are available, Restless Dude. Uh, I mean, if there were more people that were online and ready to go right now, I would totally do that. But the issue is people registered and they didn't show up. And if they don't show up, well, then there's nothing that I can do about that. You know, but I'm not going to sit here and wait for an hour for someone to show up. You know, that's, that's the reason why we changed it this time. Um... Ooh, look at that. Epic plays with a huge <laughs> shot right there. Right off the bat. That was massive. We like that uh, up close and personal. Here we go. Woo! This is, uh, this is one. This one is Ouch! Unfortunately. Yeah, Ow is definitely yeah. saying Ow right now. Wow. The, the road wow, wow, wow. Barry got squashed. <laughs> Well, they disliked it because he couldn't stream snipe. <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> Royalty, that's funny. <laughs> <laughs> that's <is> funny. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so true. That's so true. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, so that basically means that at this point in time, this is where we're sitting for our current scorecards. We only had two victors during this point in time. Two people dominated all of these games. Uh, unfortunately, there's not any other individuals from Category 1 that have not gone through and played yet. So, with that being said, Sodaldo is going to be the champion of Category 1 for this King of the Hill event. Hamfingers, unfortunately, that's the way that it works. You know, I wish that we could do more, but if I'm not, you know, we can't provide some people with more opportunities to succeed than other individuals, if that makes sense. So we're all out of individuals. Yeah. That was how fair. it was stated in the rules from the beginning. Everyone knew that this was always a possibility. Yeah, definitely. That's why I told people very early that it pays to be early. We uh, we offered up in the chat who wanted to go first, Soldado. Put his hand up and said, hey, put, put me in first. If Epic Plays would have been in first, then he would have. <laughs> Epic Plays wants to, he says he wants to play Soldado again. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> no, that's, Epic, even then, it would time. still wouldn't be, you know, uh, there's no way that I would be able to say that he would be able to win because he's only at, what, four victories now, I believe? I think that was his fifth. Was that his fifth? That was his fifth, yeah. All right. That's five victories now. But even then, sure. yeah. So unfortunately, oh, what we got here? Fright Chicken. Actually, that's another individual. Where is he? I need to make sure he's on that list. Yes, he is. All right, Fright Chicken. There we go. We got another one. There you go. Epic's got a chance. Epic has a chance to tie it up. And now if we do tie it up, I do have... We do have to allow them to go head-to-head. -head. So that's the way that that does work. I like that. All right, there we go. One. Let me get Soldado ready just in case. Blade Blow, we can only pull, pull the players that signed up. This isn't like random, pick some people from chat. This is everybody uh, signed up. We asked in chat who wants to go first. Soldado yeah. went first. That's the way it works out. It's unfortunate. There were more than enough players that are also still signed up. The issue is, is they're not online right now. I'm still looking yeah. at, there's about another four or five people who didn't show up. There's nothing I can do about that if people don't show up. You know, there would have been more than enough opportunities for anyone to have gone back and won. It is fair. Um, so, all right, let's see what we got. Fright Chitin, Chicken here. Fight, Fright Chitkin <laughs> has more health, 
but he's rocking with an interesting setup. So he's got a very quick cooldown standard cannon, but he's also got that big Berta, a ballpark mortar, explosive cannon, flare, and a standard cannon. He has the ability to put out some massive damage. Epic Plays is really going to have to continue moving. There's no way that he's not going to be able to, he's going to be able to sit in any one location. Right Chicken might actually be able to get this. Yeah, I, I'm looking at that too. Uh, he's got a 500 infamy advantage. And it looks like he's got a, a couple high level weapons uh, that we didn't, we haven't seen from any of the other players. He's got that flare, which is really nice. I'm curious what perks he's running. Ooh, man, that was a huge hit from that explosive cannon. 1,800 hit points. I don't know. This is gonna be, this is yeah. gonna be very close. Sticking him with another flare. Oh, this is gonna be end oh. game. End game. Oh, Fright Chicken comes in and ends <laughs> ends the the streak for epic plays. Wow. Yeah, he uh, kind of put on a clinic there. He just came in and wrecked him. No, uh, no questions asked. <laughs> All right. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. That was that was painful. That was very painful. Oh, wow. All right. Well, with that being said, you can clearly see here who has won the most. It is still Soldado Sahit. Thank you guys so much. Soldado Sahit, you are the winner of the 1,000 pearls for the very first Category 1 Endurance event. Congratulations to Soldado. Absolutely. Yeah, congratulations, Soldado. Well played. Absolutely. Uh, thank everybody. Everybody that showed up, we appreciate it. Uh, I don't know. Is there any more the chicken can play? No, Ch there's no one Ch else. No Ch one else Ch is showing up. There's a few people, but no one's come into the channel to say that they're there. Um, it is what it is. It's unfortunate, but there's not a lot you can do about it. All right, everyone. <laughs> yeah, we have a nice dictionary for you so you can spell his name correctly. That's funny, American Rotter. All right, everyone. I want to say thank you all so much for coming out. Don't forget, we will be live again in one and a half hours from now, all right? So that's when Category 2 will be going live. It is the set time. We're not going to deviate from that and start it early. Everyone knows what the schedule is, so we will see you all then. I hope uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Great games, everyone. Yep. Thanks, guys. Take care. We'll see you soon. I know. <laughs>